Collagen supplements have been a major trend for years, with claims ranging from plumping skin and reducing wrinkles to increasing overall collagen levels. But with so many options and promises, are these supplements really worth your time and money? In this video, we will dive into what collagen is, the types available, how they work, and whether or not they live up to the hype. Let's unravel the truth behind collagen supplements and find out which ones, if any, might be beneficial for you. So what exactly is collagen? Collagen is the most abundant structural protein in human body. It's key component of connective tissue, including skin, bones, and joints. Think of collagen as a cellular glue that gives your skin its elasticity and structure. There are three types of collagen. Type 1, found in skin, hair, nails, and bones. It provides tensile strength. Type 2, predominantly in cartilage. It helps with shock absorption in joints. Type 3, located in skin and blood vessels. It supports elasticity and structural integrity. Understanding these types is crucial as each plays a distinct role in maintaining your body's health and appearance. Collagen is not just about skin. It plays vital roles in various parts of the body. Type 1 Collagen This type forms the bulk of our skin's structure and is essential for maintaining skin's elasticity and firmness. It also supports bone health and strength. Type 2 Collagen Located in cartilage, it helps to cushion joint and absorb shock, making it vital for joint health and flexibility. Type 3 Collagen Found in skin, blood vessels, and internal organs. This type helps maintain the structural integrity of these tissues. Each type of collagen has specific functions and benefits, which is why different supplements may target different needs. Collagen production involves several key building blocks, amino acids, glycine, proline, and hydroxyproline, vitamin C, zinc, and copper. Here is a brief overview of the process. Amino acid assembly. Fibroblast cells in your body starts by assembling amino acids into chains. Triple helix formation. These chains twist into a triple helix structure, which is the basic unit of collagen fibers. Collagen fiber formation. The triple helix structures bundle together to form collagen fibers, providing structural support. As we age, our collagen production naturally declines. This is influenced by factors such as UV radiation, smoking, excessive alcohol consumption, and hormonal changes, all of which can accelerate collagen loss. The decline in collagen production starts in our mid 20s with about a 1% decrease per year. Various factors contribute to this decline. Sun exposure. UV radiation breaks down collagen leading to premature aging of the skin. Lifestyle choices. Smoking, excessive alcohol, and high sugar intake contribute to oxidative stress and inflammation, accelerating collagen breakdown. Hormonal changes. Estrogen, which supports collagen, decrease with age, particularly after menopause. Nutritional deficiencies, lack of vitamin C, zinc, copper, and proteins can impair collagen synthesis. These factors can significantly impact skin elasticity, joint health, and overall well-being, leading to many people to seek supplements to counteract these effects. Collagen supplements come in various forms, including hydrolyzed collagen. This is broken down into smaller peptides, making it easier for the body to absorb. Type-specific supplements. Some are tailored for specific needs, such as joint health or skin elasticity. Claims made by these supplements include improved skin elasticity, reduced wrinkles, and enhanced joint health. However, the effectiveness can vary. Research on collagen supplements is mixed. Positive findings. Studies such as 2019 review published in the Journal of Drug Discovery show that collagen supplements may improve skin elasticity, hydration, and dermal collagen density. They are generally considered safe, but more research is needed to confirm their long-term benefits and optimal dosing. Critical views. Some experts argue that collagen supplements may not significantly affect collagen production or lead to meaningful aesthetic improvements. They cite potential issues with research quality, such as lack of double-blinded studies and small sample sizes. There are also concerns about industry funding bias. In summary, collagen supplements may offer some benefits, but the evidence is not yet definitive. While they can be a part of a skin and joint health regimen, they should not replace a healthy lifestyle and diet. Focus on maintaining balanced diet, staying hydrated, protecting your skin from sun damage. 
So should you invest in collagen supplements? The decision depends on your personal health goals and preferences. If you choose to try them, opt for hydrolyzed collagen with third-party certification to ensure quality. However, prioritize a well-rounded approach to health, including good nutrition, skin care, and lifestyle choices. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the bell icon for more health insights. Share your thoughts or experiences with the collagen supplements in the comments below. See you in the next video.